History making is a continuous process. It is not unique to one particular era. Over time, new occurrences are observed and new heroes emerge. With the continuous growth of the human population, it continuously becomes necessary for people to migrate into uncharted territories, discovering new spaces and turning them into places. For every new place created, it follows that a new name ensures. In Siachilaba, less than two decades ago, a new place was born. Kalange bantu ne baga bona oti ba fuzi ne mas jiraba, baga ndola ko elangola ankoba, koba yo jana gurima. So baga tangu na winka, baga anda ko langa oti buse na kopuri na. Po zia zoba oti ne ba zobu jana buse noria, ba guzrogi abati inda ukun kalange. The exodus from Siachilaba was pioneered by two brothers who set out to explore an unoccupied space that would eventually be known as Ngalange. The name was extracted from the said words by the brothers who had grown crops in that area. It could happen that during socialization with other fellow men in Siachilaba, one of the brothers would excuse himself and tell them that in Ankalange, meaning, let me go and see. The Zutaka Samana was a max in Mugandi and the name of Gandhi Po, Tokazo Langa. It was all Langa, my daughter, and I would take a good senable boat to go to eat better to the Navy. To every matter to get damp, it was over now to eat with a zero yokan yet to shoot up. Kokzo can cook as Ojita. It was not in Kalangi, Rogasiga so. It was a kid to Yawaska Chiraba. To us over now to eat cup of tea to Ragoji Janapi. Poto again that was so guno, it was so guno to get in a better to Galango, Yauti to no living. One to a cigar, to a cala, to a galanga to sort it to limi, Poto has so janagic cup with Jesu to a jana. Pon on to a janagic cup to a nonga to a weeda. Pon to a so sort of a tea, ah, go with the wabanga to a jaja was shopping and a better to eat me to carry that to Poto as old cala, Cogusanko to a cigar guno con calangi. Depends the other to do it to the Wasia Chiraba. Manje no toka kala kwa tu mto kaso kuna mungalenge mto keto muno tatu jibwa alubi abu vivi ape toka kala mushero kuji kafu jesu tola diaga boto kwa boto kata we zivi pesi kata asia. Like many escapades of exploration in history, the migration of people is necessitated by a need to find new resources for sustainable survival. Isi nari yaku tinkalenge ni tuwa kasi ga na kasi kuriawa katangu na logo kuti festi. Naga Zolanga, Wagata in Nena Muscadenwe, better men Kajitabin in Kalangi Sansina. Ndao Jana Gurigabotu, no bola. Pomba Gasiga was Olanga. Now so to us all tovel and pot was what I owe. Wagata take one Kalangi and Poe, no and Biaraba and Kalango Naga Zolanga. Tonsa to Jaya would toga to Ragulanga, Pogulanga and Kotagulanga. Pot was all carried us when Pot of Gulanga or Kotagalanga. Oh, no, who was sent away in Kalangi? I would dig about two of us civil, who say Jagulija Gulia. Emblemumgena so and it was also a fagumanzi who say it. At also in Kamun, Sima Golonga or Gugulisi Bunga, good Tera Mans, about twenty kilometers. Igugulampa. So Bobu Mumudunga was also an anabo who say to Penzilla Mans, but Igulija Guliai, Nigaso Igabot. Before the migration of people to Nkalange from Siachilaba, the area was a natural habitat for wild animals. The initial settlers had to contend with clashes with elephants and lions among other dangerous game in a classic case of human-wildlife conflict. While big game has migrated from the area due to an increase to the human population, Maxon Mugande and the rest of the villagers have to contend with baboons that invade their fields. Maxon has to spend the rest of the day in a raised makeshift hut guarding the crops against baboons. As serious as the challenge of water shortage and problem animals is at Nkalange, 
there is sufficient incentive for more dwellers to migrate and occupy the still vacant places. There is a variety of crops and fruits found in Kalange. Matipsa <laughs> 